What is up guys and welcome back to another video. My name is Oman and today's analysis video is going to be about the Chelsea center back, Kurt Happy Sumo. So we all know that Frank Lampard loves to implement a possession based, high pressing style of football. When you press your opponents high up the ground, you keep a high defensive line to make the high press more compact. By keeping a high line, you rely on the offside trap to cover the spaces behind the high defensive line. And this is why when you play with a high line, you need center backs with decent pace who can make the recovery runs to stop the attack whenever the opponents are able to break the offside trap. Sergio Ramos, Harry Maguire, and Kurt Zuma are one of those centre-backs who like to defend by pressing the opponent. They don't mind a physical battle. Zuma always likes to leave his line to cut the passing lane and intercept the ball. And he also makes sure that he doesn't give any space or time on the ball to his opponent to turn with the ball. As long as the opponent has his back towards the goal, you always have the upper hand. And Zuma is very good when it comes to cutting the passing lane and intercepting the ball. And he also doesn't mind a physical battle when a striker is trying to hold the ball against Kurt Zuma. But sometimes when you defend by pressing your opponent, you leave the spaces open in the defense and the opposition can hurt you if they can exploit the space with quick passing. Zuma once again left his line to press the opponent and that has now left the space open in the defense for the opponent to take a free shot at the goal. It's a very common saying in football that as an attacker, you should always be an optimist and as a defender, you should always be a pessimist. Expect the worst possible outcome and be ready to deal with it. And you can only deal with the situation if you have the ability to read the play and anticipate the next move before it actually occurs. And Zuma is again someone who has a very good reading of the play. He is always alert to the situation and he is always ready to avoid a situation before it actually occurs. All the Everton defenders are falling back to cover the 6 yard space but Kurt Zuma is the only one who is trying to assess all the passing options and he can see Gundogan totally free at the edge of the box. A cutback to Gundogan gives him a free shot at the goal but Zuma was there to intercept the ball. Cutbacks is a move that Man City repeat a lot in their games and they also score a lot of goals from these cutbacks. But Kurt Zuma was alert to the situation and he denied a clear goal scoring chance to Man City. Zuma has a success rate of 85% when it comes to 1v1 defending which ranks him at number 1 at Chelsea.
Zuma has won 87 aerial duels this season, which again ranks him at number 1 at Chelsea. Zuma has completed 94 accurate long passes in the league this season, which again ranks him at number 1 at Chelsea. Rudiger is at number 2 with 66 accurate long passes. The only thing that Kurtzuma needs to improve is his short passing. He often struggles to find the right option, especially when pressed by the opponents. Thank you so much guys for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe.